Hey there guys, and it's time to finish this. And by this I mean... the space station. That's right, the final mission of the game is a fucking space station mission. We have to pick up just as big of a team again as the, as the last mission. And once again, they go five seconds less to do it. I really don't know what the deal is with that. But I've got nine lives, so I should be... I should be able to handle this. Oh dear. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna lose one of those lives here. Unless I get really lucky. That is not really lucky. Well, I guess we'll have to see what happens, finally. Hopefully they'll make you do the whole thing over again. Because if they do, seriously, fuck you, game. I could have made that. It's either going to be very tight or not even close. I'm not sure which at this point. Not even close is going to be my guess. Yeah. We have no chance. Not helping. Yeah, we're going to run out of time in the middle of bringing the physician up. I can see it now. Where will we? No, we're not going to make it. No, we are going to make it! Holy shit! With five seconds to spare, not bad. As much as I know you guys love it, this is the last time we are going into space. I apologize, but all good things must come to an end. Sadly, all terrible and boring things must come to an end, too, which includes this. But we are just about to the completion. And I'm sure the ending to this, which I have never seen, mind you, will be totally worth it. Just like the endings in most of the other games I have played for the internet. I have yet to play a game that had a terrible ending for the internet. I am in huge amounts of denial. Please don't take my denial away from me, it's all I have. I still think this could have been a really good game if they had worked out some of the kinks. Like the fact that it is very, very dull as you get further into it. And also maybe it made six unique missions as opposed to three unique missions and then build the damn space station. Three times. At least I didn't make you build the space station three times right in a row. That would have just been terrible. Have I mentioned that I really hate this particular piece of music? They could have put a couple of more notes in there. I mean, seriously. Oh, nine lives! It is very hard to lose the game at this point. Gimbal... Space Ping Pong is called Gimbal. Or it should be if it isn't. Ah, good old pattern that usually fucks me over. I'm on to your games now. I have become an expert at space valves. You cannot defeat me. Secondary rocket boost, rocket boost separation, go! And now we get to our starry field of space. And do some mecho. And shoot our fuel tank off into the depths of the world. Where it burns up. And do our orbital insertion burns.
And now, strap yourselves in, guys. Because we've got some rip-roaring excitement and adventure ahead of us as we place eight fucking space blocks onto our space station. In a row. And I'm sure you all are really excited to watch me do the same thing. Make the same trip 16 fucking times. So, let's get this going. Well, I question the, the wiseness of my decision to play this game for the internet. And hopefully I have to complete this mission for the first time. Because it is just so mind-numbing that I've never actually managed to make it all the way through it. But now that I've made this much commitment to it, I've got to do the whole thing. Okay, top it up so we can go through the death pipe. I still gotta question the wiseness of putting a death pipe in the middle of your space station. Huh, that's interesting. That wasn't there last time. I guess I was right. The cosmonauts are building most of this space station for us, and we're just coming through to put in a couple of blocks and call it good. We Americans are kind of like space douches. But everybody knew that. Also, I totally saw that moving bit of wall, and once again, I have to question the decision of NASA to, put, to want to put something like that into our space station. I'm pretty sure the Soviets are just fucking with us at this point. Well, hey, that's one-eighth of the job done. Sigh. Oof. I just broke both my ankles. You know, I have no idea why the entire screen feels the need to transition right there. Because it totally fucks up all the inertia. Maybe that's why. They wanted to add some fake difficulty to this section. 